It's more than just an event to honor some of the best up-and-comers and legends of the music industry. It's a chance for musicians to come together and celebrate the art form. Our Yenshin takes us to the 59th Grammy Awards. It's the ceremony that brings together the biggest stars from every musical genre. The 59th Annual Grammy Awards Ceremony, held at Staples Center in Los Angeles Sunday night, was both thrilling and touching for audience and artists alike. The night started by honoring the legendary musicians who died last year. From a show-stealing tribute performance by Bruno Mars to one of his biggest idols, the late pop legend Prince. To Adele's emotional cover of Fast Love in honor of the late British singer George Michael. But Adele's big moments came later when she won the ceremony's top awards album of the year and record of the year. Hello, Adele. Sweeping five Grammys, it was her night. This year's Grammys were also politically charged. From the much talked about Make America Great Again dress worn by a singer Joy Villa to Beyonce's thought provoking speech about confronting issues that make people uncomfortable. Issues that make us uncomfortable. It's important to me to show images to my children that reflect their beauty so they can grow up in a world where they look in the mirror, first through their own families, as well as the news, the Super Bowl, the Olympics, the White House, and the Grammys, and see themselves. The world's most prestigious music award ceremony also recognizes the industry's talented producers, writers, and composers, a true celebration of the art of music. As Toni Morrison once Yin said, Arirang News. This is precisely